right, everyone. We are looking at a different place today of the Elevator Museum. That's because we're up here on the roof. And we're gonna take a look at the machine room. And we're gonna take a little tour of this here, and then we're gonna watch it go. So starting over here, this is the Peely door controller. This is pretty um, advanced for back then, as normally these older elevators typically did not have automatic doors. And you can see the different relays, open, open resistance, the timer, all that good stuff. Over here, we have the actual logic of the elevator. You can see Salem, Foundry, Machine 220 Works. 220 volts. 220, and you can see all the different things, the different uh, texts, all the wiring. I mean, these are some big relays. And here's where it goes over to the motor. But let's go ahead and take a look at the back. Look at that, heat sinks. <laughs> It's a pretty awesome controller. Now for a little look at the motor. This is a huge, beefy motor. It's a There's Salem. Salem logo. There's the Salem logo. So over here, we have our motor. What brand is the motor? Uh, that's what I'm trying to find out. We have an Imperial motor. It's an Imperial. There's the brake right there. Nice big drum brake. And we have the gearbox, which does leak, as you can see here, but. And we got our cables that go over and this is a two to one system. So you can see over here, this is where the counterweight would go. So the, these ropes go down through a pulley on the counterweight and then up into the motor. Then down again to the actual car where it runs across and connects right there. And there's the governor. And finally, we have the little governor. Other than that, there's not a whole lot here. So let's take a look at it in action. just to kind of break down what everything is here. We can see here we have our down and up leveling, the brake relay, our safety switch. Here's our level timer right here. You'll see he'll hit up, which the up will activate. Safety's on, up's gonna activate. He stopped the elevator. Oh, now we're going down, because he hit the uh, stop too early. He's going down to leveling down speed. Down and leveling speed. Has arrived. So this is a level. This is the leveling relay, and these are the latching here. You can see these are the latched relays. So when he hits up, it's going to go up, and then high is going to kick on. Safety's on. Going up. He stopped it. 
up is going to activate. Breaks off. We're on leveling speed. Break pops off, and we're at the top. This is actually a pretty advanced elevator for its time, and this is pretty cool. That's the door control right there. Yep, and there's the main switch over there. Well, yep, so that was a little tour of the machine. Hopefully awesome. you got a little bit of understanding of how this works. It's a very simple system. You have basically an up-down relay, safety, leveling. And it's kind of neat, they have leveling relays too. That's kind of neat. This is a very simple control. But you can see down level, up level, brake relay. There's the safety. There's our timer, our leveling relay, which latches. These are the latching bits here. So you can see they latch. That's for going up, and that's for going down. High here, I guess it's high speed, so it latches on. And then here is, uh, wait, there's leveling. And I'm not sure what these are for. This is a shunt field, something like that, I don't know. Um, with a little bit of studying, you can learn how this controller works pretty quickly. And it's pretty simple. So thank you for the owner for letting us look at the machine. And that will be it.